Hello viewers, welcome to the channel Amazing Civil Engineering Studies. In today's video we are going to discuss about Total Station, its features and advantages. Introduction to Total Station in Surveying the advanced electronic instrument used to measure horizontal and vertical angles along with distance is called total station. It is also integrated with microprocessor, electronic data collector and storage system. Components of a total station Total Station is a compact instrument which weighs around 50N to 55N. It consists of a distance measuring instrument, EDM, an angle measuring instrument, theodolite, and a simple microprocessor. The components used in Total Station surveying are as follows. A tripod is used to hold the total station. An electronic notebook used to record, calculate, and even manipulate the field data. Prism and prism pole which can measure lengths up to 2 km and up to 6 to 7 km can be measured with triple prism. Battery Capability of a total station Microprocessor unit in total station processes the data collected to compute. Average of multiple angles measured Average of multiple distance measured Horizontal distance Distance between any two points Elevation of objects and All the three coordinates of the observed points Data collected and processed in a total station can be downloaded to computers for further processing Important operations of total station Distance measurement Electronic Distance Measuring EDM, instrument is a major part of total station. Its range varies from 2.8 km to 4.2 km. The accuracy of measurement varies from 5 mm to 10 mm per km measurement. They are used with automatic target recognizer. The distance measured is always sloping distance from instrument to the object. These three MODES are generally available for distance measurement. Standard or coarse mode it has a resolution of 1 mm and measurement time of 1 to 2 seconds. Precise or fine mode. It has air solution of 1 but a measurement time of 8 4 seconds. This is more accurate than the standard mode, since the instrument refines the arithmetic mean value by making repeated measurements. Tracking or fast mode The distance measurement is repeated automatically at interval of less than 1. Normally this mode has air solution of 10 mm. Angle measurement an electronic theodolite of a total station is used to measure angles. All the features of electronic theodolites are same as total station. A total station can record angles with a resolution between 1 and 20. All the instruments incorporate either single axis or dual axis compensator the latter being expensive.
control panel. The total station is activated through its control panel. It consists of keyboard and multiple line liquid crystal display, LCD. The LCD is moisture proof, can be illuminated and some LCDs incorporate contrast controls to accommodate different viewing angles. Some of the total stations have two control panels, one of each face the electronic theodolite to make them easier to use. The keyboard enables the user to select different measurement and implement modes, enables instrument parameters to be changed and allows special software functions to be used. Some keyboards incorporate multi-function keys to carry out specific tasks whereas others use keys to activate and display menu systems. Angle and distances are usually recorded electronically in a digital form as data. If a code is entered from the keyboard to define the feature being observed the data can be processed much more quickly by downloading it into appropriate software. On numeric keyboards, codes are represented by numbers whereas keyboards with feature codes are also available. Power Supply Rechargeable nickel-cadmium batteries are used for power supply. The usage time is 2 to 10 hours. Some total stations have an auto power save feature which switches the instrument off or into some standby mode after it has not been used for aspect if feed time. Basic steps involved in total station surveying. Step 1. Setting up the of the instrument along with the tripod. Step 2. Leveling of the instrument approximately with the help of bull's eye bubble. And then verifying the leveling electronically. Step 3. Adjustment of reticle focus and image. Step 4. Recording all the measurements. Step 5. Data Processing Functions of Total Station Angle Measurement To measure horizontal and vertical angles, the electronic theodolite of device is used with an accuracy of 2 to 6 seconds. For horizontal measurement of angles, any direction can be taken as reference. In case of vertical measurement of angles, upward direction is taken as reference. Distance measurement in total station To measure the distance, electronic distance measuring, EDM, Instrument of total station is used with an accuracy of 5 to 10 mm per km. The range of EDM varies from 2.84.2 km. Data processing Computation of horizontal distances along with x, y, Z coordinates is done by the instrument called microprocessor. Hence, if atmospheric temperature and pressure is applied, the microprocessor applies suitable correction to the measurements. Various software are available in the market which can be used to post-process the outputs from the device.
Usually manufacturers provide their software which lets you export the survey results into other formats. Thus, output can be imported to CAD application or software like MX Roads. Advantages of Total Station this instrument can be quickly set up on Atripod using laser plate. They are programmed with the field computation on board to calculate the area of a field. It supports native languages. It depicts a pictorial view of land and plots. This instrument has no error in recording and writing. It provides accurate measurement in addition to various traditional survey instruments. Data can be saved and transferred to APC. It has a built-in database. We can also computerization of old maps. All-in-one and multitasking instrument, from a survey of GI's development using application software programs. Fast work, saves time, ends work quickly are few extraordinary features. Disadvantages of total station the instrument is more expensive than other traditional survey instruments. Examining and checking the work while surveying can be a problem for the surveyor. Total environment surveying requires additional environmentally friendly surveyors, as it is not easy to work with this instrument. To verify the survey work totally, it is essential to come back again to the workplace and put together an image using the proper software program. Application of Total Station Total stations are used primarily by land surveyors and civil engineers both to record features in topographic surveys. They are also used by archaeologists to record excavation, crime scene investigators as well as personal accident reconstruction by police and insurance firms to take measurements of the scene. Mining the total stations is the first survey instrument used in mining surveying. The total station is used to record the entire site of the tunnel walls, roof, and to function as underground mines. The recorded information is then downloaded into a CAD program, and then compared with the designed format of the tunnel. Meteorology Meteorologists also use total stations to trace weather balloons to find out upper-level winds. Moreover, total stations are used to trace roof balloons to find out the peak of cloud layers. Such upper-level wind information is sometimes used for aviation weather forecasts and rocket launches. Thanks for watching. For now, please subscribe, like, share and do not forget to press bell icon.